Hello guys, what is up? Tara Arts Movie here with another super super exciting After Effects tutorial and today I'm gonna be <laughs> um, teaching you how to use a lot or lookup tables to color grade your footage. Now, <laughs> there you go, be ready and uh, now not just teaching you how to use a lot but I also gonna be giving you away my lookup tables made by Moa. For you guys so <laughs> what is lookup tables well lookup tables is more like um, uh, 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 like a preset actually like a preset but uh, it it has its own uh, thing well <laughs> it's kind of hard to explain but you will understand it later anyway okay so to download my lot uh, lots because there's a nine lot nine lookup tables for you guys you're just gonna go to description down below and download link is there and all you're gonna do is download it either from mega.co.nz or from mediafire.com well whatever and after you download it you're gonna find it uh, a RAR file which is uh, you can extract it with a program called WinRAR if you don't know WinRAR are you are you kidding me? Alright, so you know After Effects and you don't know WinRAR. Seriously, like, uh, alright, whatever. Alright, <laughs> there's a Google.com, there's a thing called Google, by the way, and uh, you can Google it, for the love of God. Alright, so, <laughs> and uh, yes, after you extract it, you will have this very, very cool 9 uh, folder here, and boom! It's basically, uh, I already, um, uh, like, uh, share it. You know the, the 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 color grading presets back in the like two weeks ago for Premiere Pro, but some of you guys protest because hey, I can't use it for my After Effects, and I still uh, color grade my footage in After Effects. And I was like, all right, so uh, instead instead of a preset, I'm gonna be giving you a lot, so you can use it in After Effects in both After Effects and Premiere Pro. And today I'm gonna be teaching you how to use it. So, but. Uh, first of all, this lot is for a very, 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 very flat uh, footage. So, for example, here I uh, use uh, Cine Style for my Canon DSLR. So, you see here is very, very flat, almost no color, no contrast. And if you ask me again, what is Cine Style, Tara? Well, again, Google.com, Cine Style, boom, boom, bam, boom, boom, and you can find this tinycolor.com. Just click that, boom, you can download and install it to your camera. What it does is actually make your, uh, you know, makes your um, footage very, very flat so you can color grade it uh, later. <laughs> Alright, so, um, yeah. So, after you download the lot, you have these nine lots here. How to use it inside After Effects? So, all you're gonna do is click on the video. So, you get this layer of your video, just click it and go to Effects and then utility and then you will have apply color lot just click that and it'll be right here now to apply the lot all you're gonna do um, is click choose lot and from the folder you can choose whatever you want after you choose it for example here let's say Autobots roll out boom and then I, I turn it off uh, I just turn it on boom there you go look at this Boom! <laughs> Look at that. So this is before, after, before, after. Boom! Instant movie look. Look at that. Oh my lord! I created this a uh, lot uh, with a DaVinci Resolve, which is a very, 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 very insane software. So as you see, as you can see here, is very, very deep looking color there boom there you go so before look at look at the uh, shadowy area i made it the shadow area kind of blue here boom just like in <laughs> i said boom too much actually there's a guy uh protest me like hey you you saying boom too much all right i'm sorry uh, anyway <laughs> all right so um yeah so this is kind of actually like a typical blockbuster thingy with a yellowish light and uh kind of kind of greenish bluish shadow so yeah i name it autobots rollout because it's uh, well it's kind of look like a transformer movie whatever all right so uh so <laughs> all right we're gonna try another lot which is blockbuster one you can use eight or three of it uh, well, anyway whatever i choose the cube file because cube file is like the uh, most uh i don't know used uh type of uh, lot file so cube file boom so it's like uh, more like cold tone of blockbuster 
uh, type of movie. And then Blockbuster 2, again, this is more greenish now. So you can see here, greenish shadow, blah, blah, blah. And then we got Blockbuster 3, which is a very, very cold and contrast, high contrast here. And then we got a block, we got a Blockbuster 4. Which is kind of greenish, but a little bit, little bit more less contrast there. And then we got Chicago, which is a uh, some kind of a uh, high contrast, a uh, magenta looking, which is well probably gonna be useful for you guys. And then drama, which is just like a Chicago, but with uh, with uh, low contrast looking. Look for the for a drama movie or whatever. And uh, we got war. This is my favorite actually. Uh, <laughs> Cold War. Look at this. Boom. Like in a war movie. You know, look at this. Very, very... If you guys uh, shoot some, you know, war movie, this is very, very perfect. Perfect for you. I'm gonna tell you that. But if you also want the contrast looking of war movie, boom, you get it, you get it too. Look! <laughs> so, you got it all for free from me, Terrard's movie, and I hope you can find it useful. And also... Not just in After Effects, you can also use it in Premiere Pro. And to use it, I'm just gonna be teaching you how. So all you're gonna do is click on your video and you can find it. And then left side over here, you can find Effects tab. And in the Effects tab, you get this little material looks. But remember this, this is only works for Premiere Pro um, CC because Premiere Pro CC has this Lumetri looks, which is uh, lookup tables, is to import lookup tables. So. All you gotta do is drag one of these, whatever, you know, doesn't even, you know, I'm just gonna delete this one. And then click on this one, set up, and then find the uh, folder where you download it. Let's see, let's use Autobus Rollout, boom, there you go, boom. <laughs> and so all you're gonna do is drag whatever uh, lots here on the lumeter lum looks, and drag it, and then click here to change it and choose whatever uh lots you want boom look at this very very good for war movie all right guys so i hope you find it useful this is a free completely free nine lookup tables for you guys to color grade your footage inside after effects and premiere pro and probably other programs too also photoshop but i don't know how to import a lot in photoshop i haven't learned photoshop that much but anyway you can use it i believe it I, I believe you can use it. Alright guys, so, um, Terra Arts movie here. I hope you find this useful. I hope after this you can, you know, just easily just, uh, you know, just drag, you know, click and drag, boom. To color grade your footage. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, and, well, if you find it, maybe in your video it's gonna look too contrast or to the contrast. Well, of course, you can also add another color correction, like maybe brightness and contrast, put it above maybe to make it looks better maybe uh, maybe for you it's uh, less contrast but add some contrast like that boom whatever you want all right guys so that's a little tip right there but uh, yeah i hope you find this um tutorial and giveaway useful for you guys i really hope so because i just love to help people it's just this this internet community is so crazy i mean i learned this technique from from youtube and well, why don't I share to you guys also? There's this crazy thing about internet here. It's just, oh my god, so, so easy. Alright guys, so, <laughs> there are some movie here. And I hope you find this useful again. I like three times. And uh, see you in the next cool videos and tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video, guys. <laughs> Alright, bye. Coming on.